Welcome back to Keep It Real Boxing. This is Cypher Box, and I just want to do a quick video on this subject of Billy Joe Saunders and um, Martin Murray. Now, as you know, Martin Murray this weekend uh, just beat Roberto Garcia for the WBC civil, silver middleweight title. Um, uh, he went to the decision and he won it over the 12 rounds. Uh, wasn't the most exciting fight, but at the same time, I might have been a bit harsh with Martin Murray in my uh, post-fight uh, review. Um, you know, end of the day, Martin Murray probably has been messed about a lot over the last seven months in terms of Billy Joe Saunders dropping out not once but twice, which I'm going to get to in a second. And at the same time, um, you know, having to get himself up for a lesser fight against Roberto Garcia, but instead of a t world title fight. But... Okay, you know, end of the day, he's still got the job done. Um, my, what I want to talk about is the tweet that Billy Joe Saunders put out after the fight. And I'm just going to put it on the screen now. Bear with me a second. So here's the tweet from Billy Joe Saunders that he put out on Saturday night after Murray's win. I didn't want to get arrested for GBH tonight. That's why I pulled out. Hashtag bum. But I'm sure my son Steve would be available next to, for the WBC Silver at Frank Rowan TV for Murray okay <laughs> let's just get straight to it yeah one of the things that I'm going to say is that I gave uh, Billy Joe Saunders a lot of praise after his victory over David Lemieux I thought it was an absolute boxing masterclass and he put on a great performance and I even got a bit excited in terms of who he would fight next so let's talk let's talk about this whole fight with Murray you know He's, the fight was originally scheduled for April, right? Got postponed due to injury, fine. Give him the benefit of the doubt there. Billy Joe Saunders pulled out due to injury, so give him the benefit of the doubt there. Rescheduled for June 23rd. Weeks before that, he pulls out with an injury. Now, weeks later, we find out, or closer to, the, uh, to June 23rd, we find out that Billy Joe Saunders had an arrangement, an agreement, to fight Triple G if the Triple G versus Canelo rematch didn't get made. And Tom Loeffler has confirmed that and he confirmed that in a uh, behind the gloves interview with Michelle Joy Phelps. And I'll link that into the description of the video as well. So basically what he did was he ducked or avoided Martin Murray because he didn't want to risk losing the fight and he, not only that he didn't want to risk even looking bad in that fight because it devalues him of course when, it, when he's in negotiations for either Canelo or Triple G so rather than then do the fight Martin Murray and stay busy and do you know what I mean uh, and keep himself going he decided to pull out protect himself keep himself in a safe place and wait and wait and hope that the Canelo Triple G uh, rematch falls through so he can get his fight against Triple G in a unification undisputed uh, middleweight championship fight so first of all Billy J Saunders you're not doing yourself any favours by putting out tweets like this are you let's be honest yeah because everyone knows the truth you're not fooling anyone and as for Martin Murray Martin Murray in his IFL interview after the fight his fight on Saturday said that he would fight Billy Joe Saunders, he will still fight Billy Joe Saunders, providing there were some insurances put in place to protect him so he doesn't get messed around again like he has done over the last seven months by Billy Joe Saunders pulling out twice on him. You know? But in my opinion, you know what? Billy Joe Saunders really needs to cut this out. I don't mind trash talking and stuff like that, but like if you're trash talking like this to kind of like uh, justify why you pulled out the fight, then that's just pathetic. Because at the end of the day, we know why he pulled out the fight, and it was to try and make a fight with Triple G if the fight with Canelo, the rematch with Canelo, fell through. Look, that's just my opinion on it. As always, like, share, and subscribe. Until next time, this is Cyphebox reminding you to keep it real.